Hey YouTube, um, it's Debbie and I wanted, well, a very good friend of mine requested I do a video of what's in my Ledbury. Um, I've just received my new to me oak printed um, Ledbury Bayswater, not start again, Mulberry Ledbury, um, which is smaller than a Bayswater and um, this one's for you Margaret. So I thought I'd do a quick what's in my Ledbury and also show you around the bag. Now when I bid on this bag on eBay it had the receipt with it um, and a few other bits and bobs that proved that it was authentic because I've been stung before on buying a fake Mulberry off eBay um, but the woman actually listed it as an East West and as you can clearly see it's not an East West it's clearly a Ledbury so I got it at a fantastic price and when it arrived the condition is absolutely fantastic. So let me show you a little bit around it. You can see it's got a beautiful shine on it. There's the brass plate. One of my favourite things about Mulberry is when they actually face these screws here. And um, my dad calls it facing. I'm not quite sure if that's the right terminology for it. But anyway, um, the brass plate here is nicely faced where they're in the opposite directions. And I absolutely love that little bit of a touch. So that's the front. This is the back. And I'll show you the sides. It's got the expandable sides as well. And this one has got the most beautiful print. Um, my preference on an oak printed Ledbury would be that this part here would be in the middle, um, just for a little bit of symmetry. But actually, I quite like the fact that this bit of smaller printing here is on the right hand side. It actually just gives a nice touch for me. So showing you what's in my, my bag. And this is as it is this morning. Um, again, you've got the nice suede lining here. So I've got my Mulberry Long Postman's Lock purse. Um, I am actually considering either selling this one or replacing it because one of the things I don't like about having it in the, my handbag here is sometimes this bit here kind of sticks out and I don't want that to dent the leather. So I'm contemplating buying a Daria Hobo um, one, there's a lady that's got one for sale in the Mulberry Swap and Sell and I might contact her after I've done this video actually. So anyway, that's my purse, my Mulberry purse. If you want me to do an overview of that, I will, uh, please let me know. Put that to one side. Next is my phone case, currently using my phone to do this review, that's why it's empty. Uh, next is my Giramondo Traveller's Notebook. So very, very similar to a Midori Traveller's Notebook, only made by Giulio. And this goes everywhere with me. Um, I've done a separate overview and video on this before, but it's got both my pens in, a few other bits and bobs. I use it as a diary. Um, if you want to know a bit more about that, please look on my YouTube channel and you can see I've done an overview of that one. What else is in here? I usually carry a lot of trash. Oh, here you go. <laughs> There's my car keys for my bed three, my baby that's parked on the drive, um, my fob to get in and out of work gives me access to my place of work, also means a way of logging in and out on your brakes and that sort of thing. Oh no, controversial. Two handbag hooks. <laughs> um, um, if you're a member of the Mulberry Forum, you'll know there's been a bit of controversy over these handbag hooks handbag hooks recently. Look, I use them. I don't like my handbags going on the floor. Uh, they just undo, hook on like that, and then the weight keeps them on the place. Like them or loathe them, it's a personal choice. I love them. What else have I got in here? Oh, in here is just my lipstick, some keys for work for the office, and I think a couple of sugar-free worthers. Yeah, that's pretty much it, and a bit of tissue so that one can blow one's nose when needed. There's my mulberry disc serial number and it's beautifully clean on the inside. And as you can see here as well, it's got the expandable sides, which I love. I've got this on the widest side, but actually I'm probably gonna reduce it to the next size down. I don't need to have it on the widest one. And the leather is superb condition. Oh, I can hear my husband about to come downstairs. So I'm gonna stop doing this video now before he appears. And um, anyway, ladies, that's my quick overview of my Mulberry Ledbury and um, have a good day. Cheerio.